Hello there everyone and welcome back to Victoria 2 HFM. I'm your host, Mr. Spaniel But right now, we have decided to have a slight little bit of a great war here in which, well, it's going to be us, and we're cutting down the French Republic, and Germany, Brazil, Ottoman Empire, Belgium, Haiti, and our puppets, versus France and Russia, as well as Andorra, the Netherlands, and Cambodia. Let's see how we do, and we've got some comments to go through as well, but let's see how we do. Actually, are we still building up a lot of ships? Yeah, there's our actual okay sh ship fleet, but hopefully Germany doesn't die too much, and we lost some soldiers and was on already. Wow, that was fast. Okay, anyways, um, here, head on down here if you can. Oh yeah, we have these guys over here too, I forgot about them, yeah. Um, ooh, we do have gas attack, but I think the French do have gas defense, which does suck for us, but whatever. Um, let's show up right there, go to Andorra if you can. You guys go to there, and you guys just kind of hang out, kind of in the behind the scenes-ish. We'll see what happens. Um, wow. Sorry, Belgium. That was really fast that you, uh... <laughs> I'm gonna get siege down really quickly. Russia, we'll see. The Russia is not too weak. And also, like, here's the Balkans. It, Hungary's come back from the dead. Like, they're doing really flipping well now. You know, there's not, like, any Hungarians here. There's very few compared to everyone else, but whatever. Yugoslavia's here. Um, so yeah, we'll see. We'll definitely, 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 definitely see. Um, not all of Africa's colonized yet, but that's okay. I don't know. At this point, like, I just want to... This... Oh, Japan annexed Korea. This is very odd, but, um, oh, yeah, I forgot about these guys here, too. Here, move on over, guys. Uh, yeah, I, I just want one last great war. Uh, Spain is not easy. Spain just does not have a lot of population. It's not that easy to play as, so I think this would be appropriate. One last great war. Oh, hello. Um, hmm. I prefer that one. Cool. I don't really care about colonies too much. UK is not in the war either, which is fine. And good job, guys. Keep taking out whatever you can, because right now, Belgium's a distraction, as well as Korea, the Netherlands. And there's Russia doing German Russian stuff. Bordeaux, thank you. Oh, hello. Oh, crap. Suffragette hunger strike. Nice. Uh, piss off the liberals. Hey, at least we got indoor now. At least now that's kind of. Looking a lot better, actually. I'm over here, too. Oh, that does not go. They have found us. Not I. Oh, boy. Ideal. Do we have rebels? You don't have rebels right now. Because then you guys can move here and here and here, which is not ideal. All right. Liberal upper house. That's fine. We'll do that. Maybe we get some more support and stuff like that. They've been slaughtered. Very good, very good. Put you guys as bait. Liberia, you want an alliance? Alright, we'll see what happens with that. Liberia? You will not accept? Well, then you really didn't want an alliance, did you? No, you didn't. Not really. Oh, the Dutch over there too, god dang it. I don't like them Dutch boys. They're tall. They're kind of intimidating. Actually, you go here first and then go there. Liberia refuses to join, which makes sense. Oh, are you guys attacking? Wait. Oh, okay. Whatever. Um, 26,000. If we can move fast enough, you might actually be able to destroy these guys with enough soldier. Hmm. Is that already? Or we can already end the Great War? Uh, cut the... I, mean, I guess we technically we could take more. Turn fortifications. Um, there's no dismantle country button, which I don't like. I prefer reparations as well. Actually, no, let's get reparations. I want reps. Just a little bit more time. And maybe we can demand that from them. That'd be great. Hey, we won a battle. Yay. We won a battle. Ooh. It's fine. Combine those two. Uh, you should be able to throw your weight behind these guys. Can we piece you out again? All right. We won the Great War. We didn't even mobilize. Nice. Uh, you guys go there. You guys go to Pamplona. You guys go down to Madrid, just in case. And you guys come over here, because we're going to need to make more guys. We're going to need more... Actually, we're going to need cannons. We have no cannons on our guys. Holy crap. That is not ideal. Um, so, that was the First Great War. 
Yes, we've had one. And we just got army NCO stuff done. Okay, then. Uh, maybe we'll have one more Great War, then. You know what? Maybe one more. Just because we're not done with everything here. Um, investment banks, of course. What other decisions do we need here, as well? Of course, reforms, of course. Because you vassals. Uh, this, you need Greece, I think, for this one. Yeah, pretty much. Reform colonial army. Naval logistics. Market determined exchange rates. Market determined. Oh, down there. Oh, wow. Well, we could try to go down there. And then try to go for naval logistics. Second most prestigious, the second sex. Since commend the book, more liberal. Uh, commend the book again, that's fine. I don't mind getting at least a little bit more liberal support for now. Uh, other than that, though, I wonder what's going to happen to the French. Because they're already reactionaries. Also, fascism has been founded in the world. There's actually we're 9% fascist already, which is kind of nuts to think about, but. Going to progress? Fantastic news? Yes, please. And actually, let's get out of that part there and then go to Goa. Cool. Actually, it was really, really good for us. Now we've got to figure out what is the next great war we're going to go to war with. Even though you guys are not doing too much over there. But maybe one more war, just for the fun of it. The National Banking Act. While the government has for some time maintained a central bank, some voices within the economic debate have begun arguing in favor of monopolizing the issuing of currency to a strict government prerogative. Proponents argue that this will lead to an increase in economic stability, while opponents see it as a fundamental breach of freedom of trade. Oh well for them. And now we can reform the Spanish colonial army. In the past, the amount of overseas colonial troops we had available was limited by logistic factors. Ships, orders, troops, and officers took a long time to arrive in the control of the land, coupled with the unwillingness of the natives, inhabitants, to cooperate meant that we didn't realize the full potential for colonies. We now possess the technology to change that. It increases the maximum now allowed percentage of non animus slaughtered pops and colonies from 1 to 2%. Animus pops still need to convert, but they can, uh, the, they can go over 1%. Okay. Lose some money? Yeah, that's okay with us. Um, honestly, it's just like, I'm just kind of hanging out for now. Uh, there's not really much going on. I do want to go to war with the, um... Oh, service is one? Okay, that's nice. American British Summit 1911 uh, Summit, huh? Oh god, don't tell me they're gonna... Oh boy, I do not want to fight the British or the Americans. Even though we do have Italy as an ally now, as well as Russia? Wait. Wait. Wait, where'd Russia go? Wait. Hold on. And we have a lot of prestige. We're second in the world for prestige. The world... Oh. Oh, wow. Feng Shang government? Can we... Oh. Mm -hmm. Make him a puppet. Annex. Acquire state. Make these guys a puppet would be pretty nice, actually. There's a lot of... There's a three like three different states here. That took a long time to take them out. Um... Getting a Chinese puppet under us might not be a bad thing. Actually, they they are civilized, but they're probably not that strong. I don't have them completely under us. Maybe we'll do that one. Got plenty of money. We'll have our money back, of course. Oh, and we just discovered. God dang it. Are you kidding me, bro? Eh, that's still not bad. Civilizing mission is awesome to have. Awesome, 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 awesome. Do we have any more population? Oh, yeah, we do have some more population here. Let's see. 27... Get a horse boy. A Korean Hussar. Got some infantry, got some bureaucrats down there too. Total population of 92 million, not bad. Our athletes are victorious at the Olympic Games. Bulgaria, we are trying to influence as well. Thank you very much, Bul 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 Bulgaria. Japan has peace relations so they don't attack us at all. Hopefully, eventually. We got plenty of money. I mean, that was one thing one of the people said. Um, what do you guys said? Um, don't worry about having too much money. As long as we don't go into too much of a deficit, we'll, we'll be okay, but still. And someone says we should do some CK3. Yeah, we should do some CK3. I don't know how to play it yet, but... Yeah, we should. Better tax efficiency. Ooh, actually, if we're gonna go to war, how many, how many more... How many more days? Oh, we're almost there. There you go. Spend more. Until we can't spend more. Until we have to cut down. So. Also, we did get this concession. We can make him puppet, which is really nice. Uh, the Tianqian... Tianqian concession, which is really cool. A bunch of socials there. Now let's go to war and see what happens. We won't call any of our puppets, and we should be able to do this pretty darn easily, but, you know, you never know. As soon as they're done, we'll pop them over here. Nice. Actually, after them. Uh, can we go to Beiyang? Oh, that's actually a lot of soldiers. Hmm, maybe not. Maybe we don't want to do that. Nice. Oops. War goal? No. Reparations would be nice, but we're okay. Hop in. And they're gone. Kiki Har. G. Please. 
Very military troops, more fascist support control and stuff like that. Alrighty tidy. Ching Day. Suffragettes and suffragettes. Uh, uh it doesn't really matter which one we go. I don't I don't really don't care. Nice. A lot of infamy is still being cut down. That that mission of civilized is so strong. I love it so much. Can we actually get you guys to Ooh, they do have quite a few puppets now as well. Hmm. Well, awesome. Very awesome. We got a new puppet here. I definitely didn't plan on having these guys as a puppet, but you know what? I love it. Manchu, huh? Beautiful. Market determined exchange rates. Nice. And... Ooh, wait. Why do the Confederates want to give us an alliance? Did you guys break our alliance? Yes, they did. Ooh. Let's do that. So we got Germany with us. And we get the Confederates as well. You hear that? Also, uh, we didn't do war... Okay, between this episode and the last, I did do a little war here. Or something like that. Or America declared war on us. Now, America went into war with us because... Uh, they had the, some sort of Cuban event here. And that wasn't very good. But, the, then... We actually have more Spanish people here now, too. Because it, because America went to war with us, the Confederates went to war with them, and they actually got Missouri. Ooh, can we do us, and Germany, and Russia? And not France. Against the UK, and America? That might be good, but economic reforms of the Philippines sounds like fun. For years, the Philippines' inhabitants lived mostly off substance farming and cash crops that aren't as profitable as before, with insertion of these lands in the global market. The Kingdom of Spain specialists and bankers conducted a series of viability studies to determine what crops would be grown for the benefit of the Kingdom of Spain, to contribute to its exports and industry, and what kind of investments are needed to make this happen. With the conclusion of these works, the only obstacles to these changes are the necessary investments. Nice. Awesome. You know, that's not a bad idea. Maybe we should go to war with America. Which sounds like a terrible idea, but we're going to definitely need some more prestige, get some more of that. And yeah, maybe we will take out and dismantle America. Let's see. Oh, we can go straight to war. Oh. Oh. And, oh. Well, we'll probably need more time to actually... Oh, dismantle nation. Now that one is a fun castle's belly. Well, everybody, here is the enlarged Confederate States. Actually, America went to war with Confederate States to get back Missouri, but in the end... Well, as you can see, we allied with them, but I didn't go join the war with them. They got Nebraska, of all things. They got Illinois. Left out Indiana. Took Ohio. Well, they also have West Virginia, too. And Maryland. And... Wow. And Delaware. Right? That's Delaware, right? Yeah. Um, They're ranked four in the, in the world. Wow. Um, Other than that, things are pretty much normal. The other socialist party down in America, of course. We're going to go to war with them real soon. We get universal voting in, Amer in, our, in our country, but whatever. Uh, now the UBD has been split in half. Go figure. Uh, Germany is hanging out there at level 3, or rank 3, 2 in the world actually. Third biggest military. French are not doing so great. They have the Royalist Conservatives. There's us. Ireland exists as well. Um, what war is going on real quick right now? Sixth Ch War of China's Reunification. Second Galician Liberation of Lviv. Good luck, Galicia Lodomeria. Good luck. Um, other than that, not much else has happened except Egypt is now exists too. Some rebels down here. Israel has accords on what is Israel? Um, Spanish West Africa, of course. We do have Spanish Asia, which is very nice. Um, other than that, I think. Oh yeah, the Nationalist China is here too. We're led by the KMT Chang group, so not bad for them. Not bad. But regardless, we are here for not them, but us. Ooh, there's quite a few Spanish people. Ooh, look at that nice terror cells. Oh, that's not nice. Um, but yeah, let's go to war. Well, we don't have a lot of money too, but it's fine. Yeah, this is going to be a very weird war against America. We're going to call in all our allies, dismantle their nation. Um, the Confederate States will not be called in, which is fine. Who, who will not join? Xing Zheng clique. War is upon us. The Kingdom of Spain is in total war with one of the great powers in the world in the modern age where warfare has the capability of killing millions. The very future of our nation could be at stake. It's gone out to all Spanish people. Put aside your petty differences, your day-to-day -day lives, and your personal ambitions. The Kingdom of Spain must build together, and all this are our need. Nice. Let's go on. Denver time. And then Cheyenne. And then up here too. And we'll see what happens. And pretty much everyone is going to join the war with us against them. Should be kind of nice. I'm not sure how good our ships are really going to be. But we'll do the best we can. We have definitely been working on our uh, our shippies. Ooh. 10, 10, 12. We, ten, we have Dreadnoughts, Battleships, and a lot of screens. So we'll see. If I lose a lot of screens, I don't really care. I mean, they're there to literally be destroyed and cover for us, so. This guy's pretty good on attack. This guy's really bad. Holy crap, Dalmatia. Wait, Dalmatia? Huh. Well, whatever.
Ooh, we are destroying their fleet. I love it. Do they throw more ships in? 19? No, maybe not. 18. Come on, destroy those ships. Don't lose too many of our own ships. Hey, nice. We lost quite a few ships, though. Um, you guys are still at peace, which is fine. Our guys have landed, which is nice. Why don't you, you guys go home and go to, like, Puerto Rico just to, like, repair for now. We don't have a lot of money either, as you can see, but whatever. Um, we can quickly take out enemy places now. Billings, we could try that. Uh, oh, Italy. Okay, what? Italy, Italian, uh, sure. Yeah, you'll be fine going there. Nice. Yeah, I think America's really going to be destroyed after this. I mean, we're going to dismantle them anyways, which makes sense, but still. More prestige, main armaments. Yeah, let's do that too. Are they attacking us? Nice. I think they're just mobilizing, so. That's a big deal, yo. Dupri? Oh, wait, wait, hold on. Oh, sure. Spanish War to dismantle American Empire, which is nice. Six War. Yeah, okay. Anything else besides the mantle? Cut down in size? Sure, why not? I like that one. Denver. Rapid City. Uh, definitely don't want to attack there. Definitely don't want to attack there. Definitely, definitely, definitely don't. Ooh. Nice. Well, I'll go to Great Falls, whatever it's called. Losing thousands of dollars by the day, but whatever. This is unemployed. Germany and them are decided to do an alliance. Whatever, Dickinson. Nice. Pocatello. We just have to surround these guys, so we'll go through there and there. So take you when you're done. Going to Great Falls. Nice. And you guys just stay there. We have them completely surrounded. They'll have to attack us someplace, so. That'd be nice. I really don't want universal voting though. Let them wait. We'll wait it out. That's fine. How are the shippies doing? Doing well? Nice. Oh wow, look at that. Anything else? Because we are right behind Germany in terms of score, so. Mana fortifications. Now nah, we're kind of okay. We got plenty of infamy as is already, so. There's something here. They can go up to 70 as much as they like. It doesn't really matter. As we are losing ships like crazy. Holy crap. Oh, nice. Uh, no risk management. Why not? Five more ships destroyed. Pretty good. Do they actually repair if you actually go into an allies base? 99%. Yeah, they do. I didn't realize that. That's good. Ooh, we got quite a few ships there as well. Oh, and now they are attacking us. Yay, Missoula. There. That's fine. Oh, oh. Oh, all they have are infantry. Nice. Where are they going now? Baker City? Where's Baker City? There it is. Um, oh, there's two of them there. Uh, you go down here. Boise. That'd be good. Please die for our, our amusement. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Let's come back to Walla Walla, because we do need to surround this army as well. Close them in. Make them feel really bad about themselves. The usual. Portland. Now you guys go straight to there. Be fine. That army will be destroyed, which will be good. Dominion of Canada. Eighth War of Chinese Reunification. Probably not going to happen very well. No. I want more siege down, if possible. Sure, China. Sure, guys. Sure. Just for you. There's nothing else we really want to add, though. I mean, this is going to be the last one we do. Uh, take from Sphere of Influence. Ooh, the Nationalist China would be pretty nice. You know what? We'll take that one. All right, which one are you going to go for? Which one are you going to go for? Not us. Okay. Or what if we just went in here and swamped them? That yeah, works. Oh, we eliminated all the ships. We lost a couple ships of our own, which is not very good, but whatever. That's why we got more. Not bad, not bad. 
cool. You guys head on out and keep going this way. If we attack, it'd be really bad for us. Nope. Not bad, not bad. Combine you both groups together. Some of your ships are really da damaged. Which is fine, whatever it is, what it is. Pull the siege him down if you possibly can. Yes, please. Alright, and they attack us. They're going to be slaughtered. Oh, sad. Sad. And completely destroyed! Ninth War of Chinese Reunification. Nice. Sure, Ireland, sure. Really good. Oh, South Bend, okay. Um, Fort Wayne? Why not? Grand Rapids? Nope. It is really just going to destroy America. Women's suffrage. Why would we want that? Utterly destroying everything American here. Their industry is uh, profit. Let's go that one. Eight thirty. Well, by the time we're done with them, not really. Nice. Very good. Actually, are we? No, I was wondering if we had gas attack. We don't. Oh, we can't do it against them. So we probably have gas defense. Other than that. Looking pretty darn good, not gonna lie. Actually, how's Spanish uh, Alaska doing? Percent of the world for industry, fourth in the world overall. Trying to catch it to German industry is impossible. Oh, we got some Spanish people there, look at that. Not a lot, but Spanish. Oh, Yankee. We got some Russians, got some Catalans. Ooh, Catalan peoples, huh? There we go! Huzzah! Actually, you know what? Let's wait a few more months. This is cruel. But we're going to wait a few months. We get the third army there, too. Uh, go down to Veracruz, because you can. Oh, we peaced out? Oh, they broke our lines. Oh, god dang it, you ding-dongs. Spanish war dismantle the American Empire. Ah, oh, screw it, do it anyways. Oh. Why'd they break our alliance? It was a nice alliance we had. It's a very nice alliance. There we go. Well, you can get war reps, whatever. Now we can do this. Uh, if we have to get rid of child labor, fine, fine, whatever. Get some rebels. Child labor's not that bad, bro. Alright, let's see. American colonies. One of the matters discussed in the treaty talks what to do with American uh, colonial holdings. They should not be allowed to keep these lands, but determining how they should uh, be disposed of is no simple matter. For now, agreement has been reached to determine some of the territory, and any remaining will have to be negotiated over the coming years. Take what we can. Honestly, if that's the case, um, I'm going to get rid of like four. Actually, maybe I'm going to get rid of any. Ooh, New England's here, though. Oh, yes, I love New England. Nice. It shatters America a little bit more. I'll get any more money too. Um, let's start cutting this way back. We have fifteen percent tariffs. Oh, we are. An, oh, we're a different not, conservative party now. Not really that different though. We have state capitalism though, which is still nice. Um, get some more money. Not bad. Let's see what else happens here. Just because I want to see if there's anything else that really changes. Um, let's go here. Yeah, sorry, circle. Yes. Dig deep and greedily. And for you, you need another cannon. Nice. That and go an engineer. Okay, thank you, good sir. Slim pickets. That is fine with us. Seventy-two is not bad. Could be better. And come get another group here. Not bad. 
I just want to see what America turns into after this, because do they get, like, the Great Lakes formed or something? Maybe, maybe not. They got a lot of fascist support, though. 16th Nobel Prize, very cool. Only second in the world to prestige, but we can never... Oh, that's really bad. We never catch up to, uh, someone else. There's a lot of fascism here. A lot of fascism and socialism. Universal voting. Oh, I don't want that one, but whatever, we'll do it anyways, because we're pretty much done here for this campaign. Um, the advanced naval designs would be nice. I just want to see if anything's going to flip around. We're cutting down that infamy pretty darn nicely, though. Yeah, we, we did pretty well. Uh, France, nah, we're good. Germany, you are still allied with us, which is at least good. What are the, some other wars? We have Chinese Civil War, Russian liberation of Romania and Bessarabia. Oh, Bessarabia. You probably don't want to piss them off. Yeah, Romania's not looking bad, but, but still, the Filipino martyr, execute him. <sighs> wow, a lot of conservative support went down. We're more socialist than conservative now, but we have reactionaries here too. Um, yeah, we're very politically split here, and we're losing so much money. Oh my goodness. Nice. Cut it way back. Now we're losing even more money. Okay. This is not costing us that much money, but... Ooh, all the way down. Uh, subsidies, we're, well, we are subsidizing a little bit here, too, so. Let them fight amongst themselves for that. That does help out quite a bit, though. What people want protectionism. Drink at minimum wage. Uh, it's not bad. Capital punishment. I kind of like capital punishment still. Yeah, that stuff is not bad to keep, so. It's fine. They can have minimum wage if they really want it. I don't want to see if there's anything else here for America. There should be, right? There's secondary power. Left of the world. Uh, maybe not. Game to the Simps Olympiad, not bad. They still have Philadelphia as a capital, though. <coughs> but eh, it's nice getting Alaska. Not, and, of course, New England. Yeah, there's a lot of fascist influence all over the place here now. Even in our country, it's how much fascist influence do we have? Honestly, not that much. 10%, 11%, that's about the same with everyone else. A lot of Koreans here, a lot of Spanish, a lot of Filipinos. But... I can't say. Uh, a couple things. Economics, nice. Um, our popu total population is over a hundred million, which I'd say is pretty good overall. Oh, yeah, there you go. That looks like a skinnier, weaker. Oh. Wait, now Germany's at war with Finland, Russia, and Italy. Oh, what did y'all do? Six restoration, res Russian restoration of the Order of the Baltic. Oh my goodness. Well, we might see a dismantled Russia. Holy crap! Minus 50% already? It's just... Oh my goodness. Maybe I just want to, should have annexed them. Why, why is it going so badly for them? It's because of all the... It's probably because of battles and stuff like that. Um, 330, ninth place in the world. Oh boy, yeah, I don't know. Maybe. It's getting slightly worse for them. They have Kiva, but... Hmm... Let's have to wait. Oh no, there's a lot there's a lot of German things here. It's hard to see sometimes, but oh my goodness. They did not call us into the war, did they? Something roll for that. And make more money, which is nice. Well, let's, let's see this war play out, I guess. I wish Glacier looked a little mayor to like join somebody, but you know, whatever. I'm not interested right now in anything helping you out. I just want to see the wall burn. Now nah, we're good, Ruthenia. Oh, okay, what the heck? I don't want more states, I want less states. Hejaz? Um, that's fine, they'll win that one no matter what, so. What the heck? Why would you want West Ukraine? It's not even Ukraine, it's just West Ukraine. Hungary got thick though, I like how thick Hungary is. It's a nice thick Hungarian boy. If they aren't thick, we don't want them. Well, I don't think anything is really going to happen to America. We just disabled them once, but their industry is still way too high. They'd have to be probably shattered again. But this... Why do they have fascists in Algeria? Anyways, I do want to see how this war plays out. Minus six. Oh my gosh. Oh. Both of the... We're both allies of Germany and Italy, so... What's... Oh, wow. That's a German horde spreading like crazy.
Did they peace out yet? No. So are we? So allied, which is good. This is. Oh, are we still allied? No. No, we're not. Yeah, we are. Okay. West Ukraine had no no voting rights now. Sure, guys. Oh. What happened? Fourth Russian Empire dismantled the empire. Oh boy. I want to do that against America. We did, but. All right. I didn't get social science yet, but we're doing really well in literacy anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Oh. Finally! It took us all game pain to do this, but hey, not bad. Oops, I should have not clicked on that so fast, but here. And Saba, 15% Spanish. Not bad. Oh, that's a state of others as well. Nice. Okay, that's some bureaucrats. Because you can. And officially recognized for Kassia, Chechnya, and Dagestan. I don't think that's really important to do. Extend a formal recognition of Circassia, opening up an embassy in the capital, formally establishing relations. The Russians will not, of course, approve. Same thing with Chechnya and Dagestan. Um, sign the Geneva Convention. Honestly, more infamy does not is not worth it, but we'll lose one infamy, so it's not bad. Why not? All right. Oh, holy crap! Whoa. Well, they dismantled much faster than America did. Bing dong dong bing. Wow. Okay, so now we have Russia. Oh my gosh. So we have Kamchatka. Very cool. We have Baratia. Not led by Sablan, but we have Kazakhstan. We have Ukraine. We have an extended Romania. They got even more than just Bessarabia. They got Transnistria as well. They didn't get Moldovan Bessarabia, but whatever. They've, there's a Crimea, Circassia, yeah, Chechnya, Dagestan, Transcaucasia, Poland. Why did Germany get this? What the heck? Belarus. Ukraine, of course, like I said. That's actually looking really cool. I love how this has turned out. This is really nice. They're in the world for prestige. Oh, you're probably second now, Germany. Yeah, they are. Um, wow, that's a beautiful Ukraine, but, you know, it is what it is. Maybe let's do Ukraine someday. But that's going to be it for us here. Wow, you guys probably got even tinier. But if you enjoy the campaign, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. Let me know who else should I play in Vicky 2 and certain mods in the future. Uh, but here's, like I said, the last little thing for score. We did pretty darn well. We're literally only half the score of Germany, but Spain is pretty difficult to play. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.